Welcome, Eurovision fans. Well, it's been a while again. Uh, almost done with my second job, so I'll be able to dedicate a lot more time into the videos. Uh, I figure it's time for some Duncan Lawrence again. So uh, we're going to take a look at one of his songs from Pink Pop in this video and uh, see what it sounds like. Here we are. <laughs> I need a shirt like that. <laughs> So good at portraying your emotion. Goosebumps. <laughs> That's so beautiful musically, too. It's not just the vocals and music to this, I love that so much. Absolutely amazing. Uh, you know what my favorite part of that song was, other than, you know, the vocals. I love the vocals, obviously, but the violins there were just beautiful. I'm a huge fan of violins, of course, and you include them in a song. You got, you know, an artist as great as Duncan with violins, and you can't go wrong. The sky is the limit for Duncan Lawrence and what he can accomplish in the music world. Honestly, he can do whatever he wants on whatever stage all around the world. The world is his at this point. Uh, this guy is a special talent. You know, there are only a couple singers that I feel like could have the same impact as Duncan around the world. And, you know, I mop, mop mood from it. Italy, like I've been saying, I've compared the two a lot. Uh, there's a reason they got number one and number two. And then, you know, like Kobe Marimi, I think is just a classic singer from uh, Israel. But uh, 
gosh, he is so good. So good at pushing out emotion and making you feel what he's trying to sing about. You rarely find that. And I, I, I keep saying the same thing in these videos because this guy is very special at emitting emotion and projecting it onto the listener. A special talent right there to make me be able to feel what he's singing about. And uh, he does it flawlessly here too. This is a beautiful song, Nearly Morning. I'll have to remember this one. Uh, and I can't wait to see what Duncan has in the future. So let me know in the comments section, what did you think of this song? Uh, did you enjoy Duncan's performance? And uh, if you have any more Duncan Lawrence songs you want me to look at, I'm still getting at his past concert, and then I'm going to look at some more of his Pink Pop stuff. So don't worry, I'm doing that. I'm sprinkling in a little O'Gene as well. Uh, I'm going to be looking heavily into a lot of Dutch singers. So uh, <laughs> Glennis Grace is on, on the uh, tab. I've got a lot of suggestions, so if you have any more, please put them in the comment section and I'll write them down. I keep going down a list with my side projects, like my 2014 reviews. So uh, let me know if there's any more you want me to take a look at. This was great, so uh, thank you for the recommendation. And uh, for now, Lethargic Sloth, out.